If you guys have been following along with our Staley Tudor project, you know that right now we are working on our hardwood floors and we are in process of ripping out our entire kitchen and moving it to the other side of our house. So we are going to be without a kitchen for a while. Luckily, we have our beautiful Airstream camper parked outside and we are going to be making most of our meals in this camper. So the hardwood floors we're putting in are unfinished which means that we have to not only install them, but refinish them all, mm -hmm. which means we can't install the new kitchen until all the floors are done and refinished. So we're probably gonna be without a kitchen for a couple months, maybe? I don't oh. know. Hopefully not that long. A month, we'll see. So I'm really happy to have the Anchor 757 and we're gonna review it for you today because it's really cool. The Anchor 757 is a 1229 watt hour power station. <laughs> they might, that may not mean a lot to you right now, but basically this thing will power a lot of stuff. It's a really monster battery and it's capable of a lot. So we're going to talk about it today. All right. So here we have our display screen. You have four USB ports, two USB-C ports, and six outlets. Um, it also has this pretty cool night light feature that I like. So you can like see what you're doing at night because obviously you don't have electricity is why you're probably using this. Um, you can charge this thing by either plugging it into your wall. It only takes one hour to be 80% charged. Um, you can also use solar or you can charge it with your car. So a lot of really cool ways to use this and to have it on hand. So I think everyone should have one of these in their back pocket, whether you need it for like emergencies, natural disaster type stuff, or if you're like us and you're remodeling and you need it for these kind of situations. All right, so this is a big battery, but it has these big handles. So even though it's heavy, you can totally carry it. See, it's not bad. I can like do some reps with it. <laughs> nice. Thank you. This is the back here. This is where you can charge it for your solar panels or in your car. And then this is obviously your plug. All right, so we are going to try this thing out by plugging some things in and showing you what kind of usage it takes. We're gonna turn it on. I'm gonna plug in my phone here, right into this USB. So it says that there are four watts, six watts going out. 99.9 .9 remaining hours so obviously charging a phone takes like nothing and you have all these ports so there's a lot of I don't think you'd ever really need all those but there's a lot of space for anything you'd need all right so now I'm gonna plug in our laptop which should take a little bit more let's see here gotta turn on our AC outlet here so now that we have our laptop plugged in here and our phone it looks like it's running at around 60 watts with around 11 and a half hours remaining with just those two things. So that'll give you an idea of what some like home office type things we'll draw from this. And now we're gonna test out our kitchen appliances in our camper. Anchor also has two smaller models, the 521 and 535 powerhouse with the same long lasting batteries but smaller capacity and increased portability. All right, so we just turned the camper on and all we have running right now is the fridge and then the power inverter for the DC lights. And it's drawing about 109 watts of power, um, which is really not much at all. Remember, this can draw up to 1500 watts at a time. So uh, running at its current state, it will last approximately 8.4 hours. So that's pretty much all day with the refrigerator running. Keep in mind, once the refrigerator reaches temperature, it turns off. So. Um, you can basically run everything you need all day. But now we're going to go inside and test some higher wattage things like our space heater and our convection cooktop. Ooh, it's warm. All right, so it looks like we are at 1300 watts right now um, with just about 0.7 hours remaining. So we could run that space heater for like 45 minutes maybe before this would die. So it's pretty impressive that this thing can even turn on the space heater, let alone run it for another 45 minutes because space heaters take a lot of power. Anchor also offers a five year warranty for your peace of mind. We also made burgers on our convection cooktop which drew about a thousand watts from our Anchor battery. Thanks to Anchor for these delicious burgers. So this may just look like a gray black box to you, but there's actually a lot of tech in here and it's really cool. So we're gonna talk about it. The Anchor 757 is designed to last for years and years without the battery degrading. The batteries will remain in a healthy state even after 3000 complete charge cycles. And that's six times longer than the industry average. So pretty amazing. 
It'll also put out 1500 watts, which is enough to power just about anything in your house. And it'll charge to 80% power in just one hour, which is pretty amazing. We tried it out ourselves and it was kind of weird and shocking how fast it recharged. The Anchor 757 can also be charged by solar power and can power to 80% in about 3.6 hours using your solar panels. As a recap, this thing is a beast. Um, Anchor products are extremely durable. They're designed to last six times longer than others in the industry. So uh, be sure to check them out. We'll leave a link below to see all the different products they offer. We also have a $100 discount code for you, so check that out. Thanks for watching, guys. Be sure to stay up to date with our Stately Tutor Project. We'll link that playlist below. See you next time. Bye. Bye.